Gunfire erupted inside a North Philadelphia corner store in an attempted robbery. The flying bullet struck three people last night, including a father and son. The son did not survive. Tonight, investigators are releasing more information about what led up to this deadly shooting. Thursday night, Rick is off. Bray Hall is joining us. The big story on Action News tonight is the investigation into that deadly corner store shooting that has shaken a North Philadelphia neighborhood. Yeah, police believe that the three armed men who fired the shots last night were actually targeting one of those victims. Yeah, Action News reporter Charles Watson now live for us at police headquarters with those details. Charles. Shari and Gray, sources tell Action News the store owner's son was targeted in an attempted robbery uh, by three individuals who entered the store and opened fire Wednesday evening. The victim, identified as Lumi Nunez, was shot and killed. Neighbors who knew him and his family say this is a tragedy that could not have happened to nicer people. Lord, I pray for every person that's been affected here, Lord. Shock and anguish filled neighbors as they lit candles and prayed in front of the family operated store where Philadelphia police say 34 year old Lumi Nunez was fatally shot during an attempted robbery. I just told my mom I was going to come down here and find out was it somebody I know. And it was. The shooting happened on the 2900 block of North Hancock Street Wednesday evening. According to police, three armed men entered the store and fatally shot Nunez, the store chef, in the head. We're told his father drew a weapon to return fire and mistakenly struck a customer, hitting them in the head. Both the 61-year-old father and 21-year-old customer were transported to Temple University Hospital, suffering from gunshot wounds. Both are listed in critical condition. Meantime, those who have known the family for years say they're God-fearing people who try to help everyone. They say they don't know a family less deserving of this. Shocking, bro. It make you don't even make you don't even want to come past this part. Them people don't do been, do nothing wrong to nobody. They're always good for everybody here. Mm -hmm. And and they help people. Ivan Vermeerez, who lives across the street and frequents the corner store, says if this could happen to this family, no one is safe. Well, that could happen to anybody. I could have been me actually, if I was not at work. Yeah, and the city is offering a $20,000 reward for uh, inf for anyone who has information leading to an arrest and a conviction in this case. If you know anything about this triple shooting, police ask that you give them a call. We're live tonight in front of police headquarters. Charles Watson, Channel 6, Action News. Yeah, let's hope that they can make progress on this investigation. Charles, thanks.